hey guys welcome to my channel and today we will talk about a common issue which we are facing in the galaxy note 4 and this issue is happening after the marshmallow update on this phone the galaxy note 4 and so many users are complaining about this i searched in the internet and i found so many users having the same problem and basically i was thinking that uh, this problem is with me and the problem is uh, in my hardware not in software because i flushed this phone uh, with the latest samsung software in using the kais 3 or i have factory reset the device for a couple of times but still the problem is there and the, basically the problem is what uh, the note 4 is getting fridged or getting rebooted uh, while you using the phone and it was with me for most uh, 10 to 15 times in a day so i thought i should make a video on that and i i was thinking that this problem which uh, with my device but finally i came to know that this is a software issue with the marshmallow update so in this video we will see how we can fix this issue and basically we are not fixing this issue but this is a trick so that the phone will work fine and for that you need to install one application called this wake lock power manager and open this application and select the partial wake lock feature after this the phone will work fine because uh, i have tested this application and i am using it right now and the phone is working fine so you can uh, check this application and hope samsung will listen to this problem and will fix it with a software update uh, but still don't know when they will release because samsung is too late to update their old phones and samsung always uh, does that and this time also they will do the same thing so you guys please install this application and the phone will work um, but the you can uh, the battery life will be reduced to five to six percent but that's fine because the phone is working and Thanks guys, that's it for this video and let me know in the comment section that what you are getting basically if the problem is still there in your phone or not. So tell me in the comment section and we'll catch you in the next one. Thank you.